It's always good to be in Madison Square Garden. And uh, last time, last time I said it was a walk in the garden, uh, but this time I'm not walking alone. I brought an army with me. We've got Dan Hooker, Brad Riddell, Carlos Alberg, and all of CKB. So it's different. It's different this time because, yeah, that was four years ago. This is now. We're big boys now. You know, some people on the outside will look at this and say, well, Alex has the power, you have the speed and accuracy. If that is the case, who do these little MMA gloves favor? We'll find out. But Alex, you've had a, a storied career, double champion in kickboxing. Where does this fight rank for you in your career? É muito importante essa luta para mim. Todo mundo sabe. Eu treinei muito para estar aqui. Eu fiz um excelente trabalho. É... O Adesanya está falando muitas coisas aí de mim. É, é difícil aceitar um nocaute. Bom, a gente está falando é de MMA, é, foram kickbox. Muita gente está falando dessa, dessas duas lutas, mas eu esqueci. Eu acho que ele não esqueceu. Eu vou lutar com você como fosse a primeira luta. Um, I've accepted this isn't like he's not like the other guys who I fought recently. He once he feels me, he's not gonna try and shy away. He's not going to shy away. He's going to come here and try and fight. Which you know is what I like. I like a guy who likes to fight because I love to fight. My time will be up Saturday probably around 11 o'clock. After that, we still got some go time. You guys make this special. I love all you out there. One more fucking ride, baby. I think the highest expectations are the expectations that I put upon myself. And I've been doing this for 22 years, hand-to-hand -hand combat. Madison Square Garden last year, November 6th, was the fight of the year for sure. Um, I don't think I have anything left to prove. I'm not going out there trying to put on fight of the night. We're going out there to try to get my hand raised and win that world title in 2023. We're going to find out Saturday night. That's what I'm going in there for. You guys want to see a head-on collision? And I'll give you one. You know, I'm coming in there to finish this guy, by any means. Ah, no. Hey, actually, the hot sauce is pretty dang good, all right? Hey. And uh, it was actually funny, two different times, our, our mutual friend Theo Vaughn brought it over to the house. I threw it away. Hey, but everybody, everybody knows it was actually really good promotion for the hot sauce. Dustin knows it was good promotion, promotion for the hot sauce. You know you went, got that bottle out the trash. You know you did. Tell everyone. Yeah, you it, didn't was leave it. You didn't it was good. It was good hot sauce. The official hot sauce of the UFC, I hear. Congratulations. So. Bom, eu acho que eu tenho que fazer tudo aquilo que eu treinei. Ele é o campeão. Eu tenho certeza que tudo que eu fizer lá dentro, ele vai querer responder. Com certeza vai ser uma grande luta. Eu estou disposto a enfrentar quantas vezes ele quiser. Eu já ganhei dele duas vezes. Eu falo que eu não vou lembrar, mas é um pouco difícil. Isso faz parte da minha história. Uh, last time you stepped in the cage with Alex, he knocked you out. Ring, ring. Sorry, the ring, I apologize. Uh, he knocked you out and he talked about that. He said that that's going to be in the back of your mind and that's going to affect you now. Is, what do you, what's your response to that? No. He better. He better wrestle early. I can honestly say I think I came over to the UFC at, at the right time. It was, I was where I needed to be, not just physically, but mat maturation-wise, spiritually. And then, truthfully, it was the craziest unforeseen circumstances with Habib retiring at the same time, Poirier and Connor uh, getting tied up in a trilogy. Uh, I'm right where I need to be. I feel like I've, I feel I've, I have gotten two careers, one career before the UFC, one career inside the UFC. And people ask me how I stay motivated. I feel like I'm still a white belt, brand new to the sport every single day. So I'm enjoying the journey. Saturday night, we get another opportunity to, to prove that we're one of the best in the world the best in the world, and uh, I've been working hard, and I'm excited. Uh, does it bother you at all, like that, throughout his promotion, even before his career, up until now, that his name, or your name has constantly been attached to his? Uh, no, not really. Uh, for me, even right now, I've, I've pretty much cleaned the division, and I'm, I'm lapping it again, so I cleared, I cleared the way. You know, he should be grateful. He wouldn't, he wouldn't be here without me. My, my run to the title was a lot, a lot more impressive than what he's done, so... He should be grateful that he's here because of me. Um, we've got myself, Dan, Brad, and Carlos fighting. But behind us, there's a whole army. And then behind us, 
There's a whole nation. There's a whole spirit. There's a whole manner. And you can't fuck with it. Trust me, you can't. Você vai estar sozinho lá dentro do octógono. Você vai estar sozinho lá dentro do octógono. Oh yes, you and me. Don't worry, but they're gonna be with me. They're gonna be with me in spirit. Trust me. You can't. They can't save you either. They can't save you. Hey. All this shit. Don't worry. Hey, he's got bragging rights. Talk all the shit you want. Talk all the Yo, shit man. you want. Because trust me, they can't save you either when you're locked in there with me. Ei, Adesanya, deixa eu te fazer uma pergunta. Você quer estar aqui realmente? I am here. I am here. 